So the priest puts on the clothes, and then you see there's a little staircase there that takes him up to the altar. That means once everyone has arrived in the church, boys, boys, once everyone's arrived, the, the priest arrives, and here in England we have women and men priests, yeah? Now you might not know this, but the Church of England is actually a Catholic church. It's not Roman Catholic. They don't obey the Pope in Rome, but it is Catholic. What that means is the structure of the church is from the priests going up to the bishops, then to the cardinals. Oh, sorry, no cardinals. Yeah, yeah. To the Archbishop of Canterbury, yeah? So it's quite conservative, like the Roman Catholic Church is. And not as conservative. <coughs> But um, <coughs> many people say, oh, it's a Protestant church. And yes, it is, and no, because it's from the top down, yeah? yeah? So it's only a few years ago that they decided to have women priests, yeah? And they still officially say homosexuality is wrong, officially. But in practice, many of the, the priests are actually gay men. Now, if you look up here, do you see there's a gargoyle on the top doing this? Yeah? And um, as we go around the corner, I want you to try and guess how old you think the church is. But also, you can see there's a skull. Now, in Stratford upon Avon, William Shakespeare's father, he worked for the town, and his job during Queen Elizabeth's time was he had to go into the church and he had to clean off all the pictures. He had to destroy them. And this is because at this time they didn't want it to be Roman Catholic nation. So they had to whitewash or destroy them. Um, he just painted them over. And last year they started cleaning off the paint and so on. And they discovered that the pictures are, are there underneath.